My name is Evan Greer, and I'm one of the luckiest people in the whole world because I got to spend hundreds of hours on the road and in the car with Ann Feeney. Ann convinced me to drop out of college when I was about 20 years old, and she took me on the road with her. She taught me everything I know, not just about playing music and singing songs and making a living as a working artist, but about the true meaning of solidarity. Whether that was driving hundreds of miles out of our way to just to bring some hot coffee and sing a few songs for workers walking a picket line in the dead of winter, or watching her scream her head off at the scabs and the Pinkerton thug hired guns that companies would bring in to try to break a strike, or the time on the tour when I came out as transgender. We walked into United Auto Workers Hall and I was wearing a mini skirt. And she kind of looked at me like, you really gonna wear that? And I kind of looked at her like, you bet I am. And we got up on that stage together and you could tell Anne was ready to beat anybody over the head with her guitar if they said two words about me. Because that was who Anne Feeney was. She wasn't just a labor singer, she was a revolutionary. She believed in the brilliance and the creativity of working people and oppressed people all over the world, and she fought for everyone. Anne was a great songwriter, but she was also a song collector. She knew a great song when she heard one, and she would just dust it off and give it life, and she kept so many important songs alive. And if there's one thing that I know about Anne, it's that she wouldn't want us sitting around on a day like today singing sad, sappy songs about how much we miss her, even though, God, I miss her so much. She would want us to honor her and celebrate her by carrying on the work that she always did, which was using music, using art as a tool and a weapon to fight for the working class, to, to fight for liberation and justice for everyone. And so I'm gonna sing a few of the songs that we used to play on the road together. These are old songs, they're union songs. They're songs that Ann Feeney kept alive and they're songs that Ann Feeney would want us to keep alive. There once was a union mate who never was afraid of the goons and the ginks and the company finks and the deputy sheriffs who made the raids. She went to the union hall when a meeting it was called. And when them legion boys came round, she always stood her ground. She'd say, you can't scare me. I'm sticking to the union. I'm sticking to the union. I'm sticking to the union. Oh, you can't scare me. I'm sticking to the union. I'm sticking to the union till the day I die. Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Oh, which side are you on? Don't scab for the bosses. Don't listen to their lies. Us poor folks haven't got a chance unless we organize. Now tell me which side are you on? Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Oh, which side are you? Are you poor, forlorn, and hungry? Are there lots of things you lack? Is your life made up of misery? Then dump the bosses off your back. Are your clothes all patched and tattered? Are you living in a shack? Would you have your troubles scattered? Then dump the bosses off your back. Yes, just dump the bosses off your back. Working folk of all countries unite Side by side, for freedom we shall fight When this world and its wealth we have gained To the grafters we'll sing this refrain You will eat by and by When you've learned how to cook and how to fry Chop some wood do you good and you'll eat and that's sweet by and by that's no lie tis the final
conflict Let each stand in place The international working class Shall free the human race Oh, tis the final conflict Let each stand in place The international working class Shall free the human race I love you, Anne Feeney. Rest in power. We'll keep it going. We'll keep fighting. We'll keep singing. We love you.